Ahoy and welcome back to Build It Up Lessons. This is Shipwrecked Pirates Vocabulary Warm-Up Build 3. Our learning intention is to extend your writing by using the challenge vocabulary and focus sentence structure. We are going to unlock your writing potential by following the build steps for success. They are brainstorm, understand, incorporate, loop, and develop. We have completed build one and two. Today we are focusing on build three, where we loop through all the words that we've been focusing on and the teacher sentence that was created. Then we are going to develop a sentence together. You will need your writing paper from the previous build one and two. Your brainstormed words and the teacher sentence should already be on this paper. Read through your brainstormed words and the teacher sentence. You have 20 seconds. The timer starts now. Five, four, three, two, one, time's up, well done. Understand challenge words. Abandon, to leave or be left alone. Secluded, a place that is not visited often. Treacherous, very dangerous. Stranded, unable to leave or escape. Incorporate, complex sentence structure. When, comma, who, what they did, because, why. When, when did it happen? Who, who is it all about? What they did, what did they do? Because, why, why did they do it? Challenge words in sentences. Abandon, to leave or be left alone. During the lightning storm, Captain Feathersword ordered his crew to abandon ship because it was taking on water. Secluded, a place that is not visited often. After being washed ashore, the hungry pirates searched for food on the secluded island because they were slowly starving. Treacherous, very dangerous. During the storm, the mean and nasty pirates encountered treacherous seas because they lost their way in the ocean. Stranded, unable to leave or escape. After the storm, Captain Blackbeard found himself stranded on a tropical island because he was knocked overboard. It's now time to develop the we do sentence where we work together as a team to build each step of this sentence. When, comma, who, what they did, because, why? And I have all of your options colour coded there for you. Before we jump into the writing, let's have a quick look at my traffic light on the right hand side. This traffic light gives you writing options. You might like to copy the we do sentence as we build it or slightly alter at each step. Not a problem. Or perhaps you have your own ideas and you'd like to write your own. Not a problem at all but just remember that you need to follow this structure as we go. Let's now start with our when comma. There are your options in blue. When did it happen? Let's look down at our options and scan. I quite like 
after the storm. So I'm going to start with after the storm, comma. Use your options, copy, alter, or write. Now, who? Who is it about? Let's scan through our options. I quite like Captain Feathersword. Captain Feathersword, what a great name. Choose who is in your sentence and write it down now. Now let's look at what they did. What did Captain Feathersword do? Scan through the options. Remembering you could copy, alter, or write your own ideas. I really like search for food on a secluded island. Now let's look at what we need to do next. Do I jump straight into why did they do it? No, I need to make sure I, ha I write because. Fantastic, write because in now. Now we jump into the why. Why did they do it? Why did Captain Feathersword search for food on a secluded island? Hmm, let me look at my options. Scanning them now. I quite like his ship sunk. His ship had sunk. Fantastic. Let me just double check that I've followed the structure. When, after the storm, who, Captain Feathersword, what they did, search for food on a secluded island, because, I have to remember that, and why, his ship had sunk. Awesome. Now, do I have a challenge word? Definitely, there it is, secluded island. Make sure your sentence have, has all of those options. Well done, my hearties. You have finished build three. The next is build four, where we loop through all of the words and sentences, and then you show what you have learned by developing your own sentences. Make sure you tune into that one.